In order to win games, you have to score goals. In this video, I'm gonna give you three techniques that you can use to put the ball in the back of the net. The first shooting technique I'm gonna go over, in my opinion, is the most accurate. Inside of the foot, creating spin, creating whip on the ball. When you hit this ball, the ball should be spinning this way. It's curving, just like that. So when you come around the ball with that inside of the foot, you're trying to wrap your foot around it and bend it into the corner of the net. With this one, you really can put the ball wherever you want. Far post, near post, start it wide and bend it in. Start it into the middle and bring it back to the near post. Just different ways to use the inside of the foot to beat that keeper. One of the biggest misconceptions though when using the inside of the foot is, is you know, people think you don't need power. It's all about accuracy. Like I said, it is accurate, but you still have to hit the ball. Get that spin and try to find the corner of the net. Like I said, you can go far post. The other option is near post. Right? Making the goalie dive. So at the very least, maybe you get a corner kick or a rebound. But still, it's on frame, it's accurate. I'm not trying to be a hero, I'm just trying to test the keeper. With the inside, like I said, you can go far post, you can go near post, you can go top corner, you can go bottom corner. With the inside, you have a lot of control. Use that spin and put the ball wherever you want. The second technique I'm going over is obviously gonna be laces. The top of the foot, maybe a little bit of inside, but definitely touching the laces. The biggest misconception with this one is, when you're a little kid, you think you have to go straight on. That's obviously not correct. Go more from an angle, put that, hit, that foot here, a little bit tilted, and strike with your laces. When you're using the inside, the ball was spinning like this. With laces, you're looking for a knuckleball. You don't want that ball spinning. You want it just going like this, maybe moving a little bit, but again, not spinning at all, just straight power. Don't forget, one of the main keys when using your laces, follow through. Land on that shooting leg. Test the keeper with pace. Get that ball to knuckle. Try to do one more for you. That was good, low and hard. That's gonna be a tough save for any keeper. See, that's a save. First one, great. Second one, that's a routine catch. Let's do one more. See if we can get back in the winning column. Again, not perfect, but again, it's gonna be a tough catch for any keeper. Maybe he gets a hand on it, tips it over, but again, I'm not trying to be perfect. I'm trying to hit more with power. With laces, yes, you are trying to be accurate, but you're really, the main thing with laces is pace. If you're 30, 35, 40 yards from goal, in order to test this guy or her, you gotta hit the ball, and laces is a good option. Just a lot of pace. If you hit one right in the corner, amazing. But at the very least, maybe you force a rebound or force a corner kick, right? Hit the ball with power when going with the laces. The outside of the foot shot is kind of like a hybrid. It's a mix of the inside because you need that bend, but it's also like laces because you, you need some power. If you hit it harder, it'll swerve more, okay? Use the outside of your foot right here. Hit the outside of the ball, boom, and try to get that bend. Remember, get that spin. Try to get it going towards that back post come across the ball. Like I said, that one's not for everybody. But again, if you do have it, it's just good to have in your back pocket. So if that perfect scenario pops up where the outside of the foot makes sense, you know, you have it ready to go. Get that curve, get it bending towards that far post, outside of the boot. There you have it guys, three shooting techniques that really anyone can learn. The basics, right? We started with inside, we went laces, then we went outside. Three parts of the foot mash them all, start scoring goals from all over the pitch. If you like the video, make sure you like it. Make sure you, you know, look at our other videos too. A lot of good stuff in our library. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video.